Listen, ladies and gentlemen, John Morant and Shannon Sharp had to be separated this evening at the game, the Memphis Grizzlies game. It's, it, it's been crazy. We Listen, it's about to come to blows at the Crypto.com arena, y'all. Like, 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 yo, I'm, I don't know what's going on. All I, all I heard was Shannon Sharp saying, no, no, you won't. No, you won't. It's, it, it seemed like it went around the lines of John Morant's father said he going to do this, this, and this to him, and it, and it didn't go as planned. But I tell you what, you know, it, 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 this shit was just hilarious as I'm watching it in real time, and then now I'm getting a better look at it. You know, um, I don't know if T. Morant, that's his name too. Shout out to T. Morant. John Morant is doing his thing, you know, this season. You know, uh, but we all know Club Shay Shay, Shannon Sharp, who he riding with. He riding with Mr. LeBron James. You understand? Full, full and wholeheartedly. So I wouldn't be surprised if some things were said. But this is the battle. You know, uh, this Shannon Sharp, I mean, you're a father at the end of the day. Come on, y'all. We got kids watching. You know, y'all supposed to be setting an example. You know, uh, we got to understand that as well. You know, we can make uh, comedic, you know, remarks of all this, but these are two grown men, you know, at a sold out crypto.com arena, children watching, and y'all are coming to blows like that. You know, especially, you know, both of them, you know, but Shannon Sharp, you know, I mean, I, I don't know what was said, you know, so I think further along, we will get the details of what was happening, but to their credit, they both bought tickets. They should be able to, you know, voice their opinions, you know, and we got to come out, out, out of the realm of trying to fight and only come to blows just because somebody got a difference of opinion or somebody has different thoughts. I mean, we got to get out of that. You know, I'm still uh, going to be monitoring. Make sure you hit the like button and you subscribe to Flight Sports TV because we will be bringing more details as they emerge involved in this situation. This is just embarrassing. You know, uh, with Shannon Sharp, you know, um, I, I I don't know what happened, man. This is tough. You know, y'all let me know y'all thoughts when y'all first seen this initial, you know, situation. Like I said, this is all taking place live right now. You know, at the crypto against uh, the Memphis Grizzlies. You know, the score is going back and forth, but you got Memphis up. You know, as I'm speaking, you know, their favorite to win. They're coming in hot, 31 and 13. The Lakers are not doing the best. You know, but it is what it is at the end of the day. You know, it's crazy that they had to be separated like this. Like I said, I'm going to continue to echo these statements, you know, with Shannon Sharp. You know, this is crazy, this altercation. You know, um, I'm still looking at it right now where they were seated. They they were seated not too far away from each other. You know, I'm, 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 I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to get a good, I'm trying to get a more and more bird's eye view. This, I'm getting angles and angles of the situation. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what sparked it, you know, but they were, they were coming at each other's faces and there was some pushing going on. So I don't know if Shannon Sharp was, was or I see the Memphis Grizzlies players coming to aid, you know, his father, you know, or, or this, I like I said, I'm, I'm looking at what happened. A lot of people, a lot of people came to separate these guys, these grown men. But T. Moran's dad wasn't scared of some as hundreds of people, you know, basically trying to corral them, you know. But I, that's why what, what what the beef was about, you know. I hope it wasn't a situation of what he said. All I all I heard is I bet you won't. I bet you won't. Um, Shannon Sharp before being separated and escorted away, you know. Uh, that's all I'm getting right now. So uh, from the, what I'm thinking, potentially uh, he may have threatened, you know, Sharp. You know, said whatever. That's all. That's all I could take. You know, from why these statements are being, you know, coming out like this. That's all I could really, really say about the situation. But this is ugly, you know, to say the least. You know, in my humble opinion, this is this is not a good look. You know, for uh, for Memphis, for for John Morant, for nothing. You know, this this sucks. You know, in my humble opinion, you know, take it or leave it. You know, I want to know your thoughts, man. Like I said, let's get in the comment section. Let's politic this out. You know, we're going to be bringing more content to the people, you know, and these teams going to see each other in the, in the future, you know. So uh, hopefully these two men, they could they could work it out, you know, for the sake of, you know, the youth, you know, for the sake of themselves, you know, because like I said, hopefully they can sit down and really evaluate what just transpired. To really say, hey man, this was this was embarrassing. This, this this made this made absolutely no damn sense. 
you know, what, what, what did we just do? You know, and I hope that's, you know, the overwhelming, you know, thought process of these two great, great men, you know, that we all love. You know, like I said, T. Morant's father, you know, very vocal. You know, I do. I don't feel like he gets the recognition or the publicity. You know, I don't for whatever reason. I don't know if it's because they're in Memphis, you know, but he, he's a he's a great basketball father, you know, and. He's, he's very well loved in the city of Memphis, you know, and he's, like I said, he's been with John Morant since the moment he's been drafted. We seen when John Morant was drafted at the podium, we seen the father at the podium, you know, and John Morant was very emotional, thanking his father. His father put a lot of work into John. So I just hope that it wasn't a situation where they got into it over, you know, a difference of opinion of, of play styles and things of that nature, because that, that just that takes the fun out the game, you know. And like I said, people should have the right to feel and voice how they feel. If somebody feel like, hey, man, I don't think your son is this, this and this. It shouldn't be to the point where guys are ready to come to blows. You know, um, these are these are both millionaires. You know, um, and like I said, this is embarrassing. You know, LeBron James, you know, I'm pretty sure he's going to have to speak for this. John Morant, you know, they're going to put the put the microphone in their faces to get this. So this is this sucks for both parties, you know, and, you know, I don't know how this would affect, you know, their access in the future. You know, because you can't have a, a dispute like that and expect to come to the game again. You know, not to say that they're banned or anything like that, because it's not like they came to blows. It was just a a high profile altercation, you know, and they had to be separated and it looked like guys were escorted out the building. You know, uh, all this happening in LA is just crazy. And it, and it's not good to have the players involved because the last thing you need is one of the players, you know, uh, stepping in because whether you want to say Shannon Sharp is this, Shannon Sharp is that, you know, this could have potentially been a, 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 a mini malice in the palace. You know, technically Shannon Sharp is a fan you know, he's not a player. He does not work for the NBA. He's sitting there. If one of those players attacked him, you know, we looking at a malice in the palace, you know. So this was this was a situation that could have really escalated, you know, into something even more, you know. But thank God it didn't go down like that. Uh, but listen, man, uh, we're going to be monitoring this situation. Like I said, I want to get more and more details as they emerge. We will bring it to the people. We are live right now. So if you want to get quick, up-to-date results, make sure you tap into our live stream as we bring things to you. I want you to hit the like button. Salute to everybody. It's Flight Sports. We, we provide a lot of sports content, news, updates, and more. You know, peace and love to everybody. Salute. We're going to get to the bottom of this, man. Let me know what side y'all on. What's y'all thoughts? What the hell did we just witness at the crypto? It's Flight Sports TV. You already know what it is. Peace and love.